Yarrabah is a predominantly Aboriginal community southeast of Cairns. We're probably one of the largest Aboriginal communities in Australia. Yarrabah Seahawks Juniors are one of a small organisation in the community and we do a bit of work developing fostering junior rugby league. Yarrabah Seahawks Junior Rugby League have been out of the local competition for the last few years. So this year we got together and decided to bring back the junior league into the competition. We've been out on a limb for a number of years. Uh, we felt we needed to do something with the kids. Everybody sort of chipped in, helped out where they can, from parents and families to the sponsorship and to the leadership and the organisations. This year we, we managed to get about 175 registration. That was a lot of hard work. It has been really rewarding since we've come back into competition again and yeah, enjoyed working with the kids and putting a smile on their face. And along with the PACE program, which is parent and community engagement, it's predominantly based around engaging parents into the education life of their children and getting more kids back to school. So PACE supported uh, Junior League in terms of getting their jerseys, all the uniform, all the gear and stuff to uh, support them, bit of, bring a bit of pride back into the community and with the, the little ones. It's really good. I love doing it anyway. Um, and it keeps me active too, like getting out of the house and participating in community events and meeting all the community members and parents. Putting smiles and laughter on, on the face of parents and grandparents as well. So a lot of the grandparents and parents have come along to most of our games as well. So it's really about the kids, um, engaging them and um, providing fun and enjoyment. Along with um, supporting that, we've had to set some criteria that kids who play also have to go to school, so no school, no play. Education is one of our most important aspects and engaging kids and parents, getting them to school every day is always a challenge, but this is one of the steps that we've taken to ensure that we're going to try and let the kids know that education is important as much as sports is important. It's really worthwhile and it breaks down that barrier that's often there in communities. Yeah, so it's really good. On behalf of the community, I'd like to acknowledge our elders, our past and present, TOs of the land we stand on today. This is um, our football field, known as Dilara Obo, and we just like to welcome you to the country and you give me honour. And it's a blessing that um, our little tribal children here have been nominated for this award. Basically in the community we just keep chipping away in, in terms of what we're doing. It's important also to be acknowledged and to be recognised. The kids have absolutely enjoyed the competitions and I remember the first day they all ran out with their um, uniforms on after being out of the comp for a few years. Just the pride on the kids' faces. It would show that all of the hard work that's gone into bringing Junior League back this year was, wasn't in vain.